in five days me's got head to paris seven days we head to disneyland so excited thought i would do like a little vlog leading up to it and while we're there a couple of days ago i spent six hours tidying my room and i'm not completely done so it still looks a mess and i'm not like completely happy with it i'm going to finish that off first but loads of things in my bed that i want to clear off so i can like sort my bed in out and sort my bed out um, okay so i've taken half of my washing down while i sit and sort my clean laundry out into piles because i sort it into piles it makes it easier for me to put it away <laughs> give you a little update obviously i haven't uploaded on youtube in over a year like mental i've been so busy with work that i'm not having the time to actually have a social media life i post on tiktok all the time because obviously tiktok is a lot easier in a sense because they're shorter videos you can do that in five seconds i'm just gonna give you a little update last time you saw me my hair has actually grown i now work for morrison's daily i'm still at the same exactly the same shop the company just changed because obviously morrison's bought at mccall's worse i hate it i don't want to work there anymore i'm looking for a new job that job is actually making me so ill mentally and physically and emotionally see when i started in 2021 i was um kickstart for six months then i was a sales assistant for three months and then i was supposed to be a supervisor for a couple of weeks to help out i am still supervisor it's my situation with work we're overworked and underpaid 2024 I get paid the bare minimum, so I'm given the bare minimum. Like, I'm not making myself more ill than I already am. Like, the one good thing about my job is the fact that I've been able to afford to do the things that I've done this year. Like, without this job, I would not have been able to afford to go to 11 concerts. I wouldn't be able to afford to go to Disneyland. I wouldn't be able to afford to go to Paris. If you don't follow me on social media, you wouldn't know that um, Simba, my big fat ginger he had to be put down in january last year we were talking about getting a cat and it just so happened that my work colleague's friend's cat had kittens so we have two cats smoky and apollo love baby this is my little smoky Apollo is a girl, was supposed to be a boy. I switched them around because they looked identical as little kittens. But now you can tell the difference between them, which is so cute. I love them. It's been like two hours and I made zero progress with my room because I had to go downstairs and put all the Christmas decorations up down there. So, clear off my bed, do my Christmas decks, chill, and then I'm done. So this is what my bed looks like. I want to clear off my bed so I can do my little Christmas tree. But the good thing is my Christmas tree is already made because I didn't actually take it down last year. I just put it in a bin bag. I'm actually gonna set up my Christmas tree now to get it out of the way. Like, there's just things on this Christmas tree that just make sense. I'll show you what it looks like in the dark as well. Under it is like a little penguin wonderland. And then obviously we've got some fake snow here. I'm now going to set up my other window. I've already done one window and this is what it looks like. So we've got like some snowflake decals and I've put fairy lights around the window. But on the other side, I'm going to put these ones up. Obviously, it is backwards for me, but I like it. It's really cute on how I've done it. And I stuck some tinsel there and some tinsel there. And then that is all I'm doing for Christmas decorations this year, to be fair. The flowers from my girlfriend finally died. I actually got given those flowers 
on the 1st of November on our first date and they died a couple of days ago so they died like a month later so that's actually pretty good for some flowers to be there okay so my plan now is I need to take everything off my bed and I'm basically just gonna remake my bed and make it look better than it does because basically half of the stuff on my bed I actually sleep with on my bed like I just push it all to the radiator I've decided to like just pull everything off my bed and remake it entirely. This is the situation right now. We are going to go through all my bears and I'm going to tell you who they are. We have Pengu. This is what my girlfriend got me on my, well, on our first day. Bought it a brother. So this is Pingu. This is Mumble. This one is Nibbles. This one is Snowy the Polar Bear. This one is Snowy the Bear. This one is Klaus the Wolf. This is Sky. This is Pascal. This I called Tentacles. This is Sparkles. If you have any names for it, let me know. This I can't remember what if I called it anything. This little alien is called Stardust. It's Harry Potter, but I call him Hasbaz. And we've got this. This is Mui. The big one's Mui. And then the little one is Baby Mui. This is what my girlfriend got me for my birthday. This is Captain America. This side is Joytopus. This side is Sadtopus. Then we've got Simba. This is a new one and it hasn't got any rain. It hasn't got a name, but I'm thinking of calling it Rainbow. Then we've got Boba. I've got this one, which is called Mint Chip. Okay, so this is the teddy setup. We have my small penguins and my small polar bear at the front, and then we've got bigger ones at the back. That was there last time, so I just put him back there because he's vibing. And cuddle body, so Mimi is staying right here so I can easily grab him or her, I don't know yet. Always sleeps on my pillow with me. At the moment, Mui is my favourite cuddle buddy. We love Mui. Can I look to see what I got for um, my birthday? You can. Also, let me show you my keychain. Well, technically, it's um, loads of key rings on one key. It's currently the situation of my floor after taking everything off my bed and now I have to find somewhere for it all. I generally can't believe that I pulled everything off my bed when I spent six hours tidying it a few days ago. I made it worse and I don't think I really want to so I'm gonna chill for a bit I'm gonna have a little break and then I'll get back. I've cleared the majority of my floor I've got a walkway that'll do for now and I'll like clean it properly when I'm back from Paris. Literally got work tomorrow well from tomorrow up until friday and i'm not excited for it so. um i've just got to take these couple of things off my bed and then i'm done i'm gonna have a bath wash my hair pretty much how the rest of my night's gonna go to be fair these are my pjs to put on after i've had my bath this is what the tree looks like in the dark the little penguin area. Sure so I'll see you in the Paris vlog, which is really exciting. 